We're pulling out of Matt Stone Racing. We're in Yadala. I might have to go and get some lunch, I reckon, with Jake Kostecki and Zane Goddard. Jake, how did you win the fight to drive today? I don't know. I sort of just muscled him out the way. <laughs> he has put Got three seatbelts seat. on. <laughs> I'm a bit scared. <laughs> Doesn't look overly trusting in the back seat. So how's life at Matt Stone Racing going, boys? Yeah, really good. Like, I think me and Jake are enjoying it a lot. Obviously, team's improving a lot year by year. So, yeah, compared us to this time last year, I think we're in a much better spot. So, no, nah, I'm really enjoying it. The whole team's got a good atmosphere. And, yeah, Matt's put a lot of trust in two young guys to race his cars. And I think at the moment, we're doing a pretty good job. So, just got to keep that up. Obviously, Matt and Jason have put the put their trust in me to do the job, which is a cool thing. So I just have to do the best job that I can and that's what I'm doing so far. It's, I hope it's showing at the moment and um, hopefully we can start getting up there even more this year. So in your pathway to supercars is a li little different to Jake's. Pretty much the second he could walk, he was in a supercar, but you went the open wheeler pathway. Are you happy where you are in supercars or you want to delve back into that world one day? Uh, no, I'm pretty happy with where I am. Like when I was young, I used to love the supercars and stuff. It was one of those things I wanted to try see if I could make it to Formula One or you got there though didn't you yeah I was in Mercedes F1 won a couple of championships <laughs> but... so after you won the Formula One World Championship you're like oh, I think I might make a move to supercars do a yeah. super light program <laughs> yeah pretty much <laughs> life on the Gold Coast I love it really um, obviously moved away from the family a couple of years ago and here by myself on the Gold Coast but no it's it's good fun it's a lot different to WA but it sort of has some similarities Jesus. there as well. It's cutting a fun. <laughs> That's what we do, boys. <laughs> How do you two go as, as teammates working together? Because you guys don't seem to have that massively you've got to beat your teammate vibe about you. Well, for me personally, I don't... In the sport, you need a teammate to actually be up there because everyone else has a competitive teammate with them. So for us, we try to help each other out as much as we can. You mentioned you've been racing each other for a while. You guys knew each other way back in karts. Yeah, been racing for a long time. Like, I can't remember exactly when, like probably around like 11, 12 years old, something like that. But yeah, it's been a fair while. Like when you think we're 21, that's half our life ago. Yeah, right. So it's pretty crazy. Right. We've, we've teetered around the edge of this story before. What is the story with you breaking Jake's hand? Um, Oh, so it was Rotax Pro Tour, so it's okay. like a championship for the year and top three in the points get to go to the Worlds. Right. So I was like right on the cusp and I was having a shocker weekend at Geelong. <laughs> so I was just throwing some Hail Marys down the inside <laughs> of people. I pulled one off like a big move on someone like before and I was like, oh, I'll just try to replicate that. And then I was like, all right, maybe this is a little bit further back than I thought when I was lunging. And I was like, oh, he won't turn down. And then he started turning to the corner. I was like, oh, no, this has gone bad. <laughs> and then I just did a 360, like, on top of him. Oh. And I remember I was in the gravel trap, and he was complaining about his hand. And I was just thinking about the points at the time. I was like, Sharp, I don't care about oh. this. <laughs> is, all, is all forgiven now? Nah. <laughs> Not after he's heard that story. Yeah. <laughs> we just uncovered some fresh wounds. All right, well, we're here. It's going to take Zane, up. like, 12 attempts to get out and... Uh, so you just tell us what you want. Actually text us and I'll get it for you. Thanks boys. Good chat.